Hello there, this is Kevin from KevinDeRue.com and today I'm coming to you with another two minute tutorial. Today's two minute tutorial is going to be on time management. And of course, time management's arch enemy procrastination. Okay? Now, like we talked about yesterday in our tutorial about self talk, the first thing we need to do is to identify or become aware of um, the activities that we are doing that aren't really conducive to our goals. So really become aware of our actions and ask ourselves the right questions like the questions that I gave you yesterday. Okay? Is this activity, is this action that I am doing helping me reach closer to my goal? If it is, great, keep doing it. If not, then we have to stop doing that and replace it with something else. Okay? Now the best way to overcome time-wasting habits is to acquire the habit of scheduling. Okay, We've said many times on this blog how important it is to have a daily method of operation. Okay, Or re it's often referred to as a DMO. Okay, Now your DMO should be looked at every single night for the next day. Okay, So allow yourself planning time the night before. Then if there are certain tweaks that need to be done the day of, they can be done then. But always make sure you plan the following day the night before. Okay? So have a schedule, allow planning time. Okay? Now once you're aware of the habits that you perhaps have that are not conducive to you reaching your goals, you can then replace those habits. Okay? You can identify your self -defe defeating habits and replace them with contrasting habits. Okay? And then you can practice those new habits consistently over 30, 60, 90 days. They say, I think. I think the, the number is 21, 27 days. If you do something consistently for 27 days or 21 days, it becomes a habit. It becomes really a part of who you are. So, you know, these people who have 30-day challenges, 60-day challenges, they it's, it's a fantastic idea, and I really encourage you to take part in a challenge like that so you can get some great habits ingrained into you and that will greatly help you towards your success. So replace the self-defeating habits with contrasting habits. Okay, Repeat them consistently over a period of at least 30 days. And then those new habits will become a part of who you are and you will find that your procrastination has gone way down. Okay, probably not, you know, gone altogether, but you'll find you'll find a great improvement in your time management. Anyway, that is it for now. I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. We'll see you again tomorrow. Bye for now.